Good morning, good morning. Ako po ay nagagalak na kayo makasama ngayong ating Thursday devotion. So bago tayo mag-umpisa sa ating um, devotion, manalangin muna tayo. So, Heavenly Father, we praise you and we glorify you for you are so great in our lives. You are perfect in all your ways. We thank you for this beautiful morning that you have given us the opportunity again to experience your goodness. Lord, may your presence be with us. Holy Spirit, come in power, saturate us, touch our hearts, our minds, that this message today will become our life. We thank you and bless this day, O oh God. And may our soul bless you as bless you. We pray this in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Again, magandang umaga. So, nung bata pa ako, narinig ko to palagi kong narir uh, bata. Siyempre, bata. No, high school. I think high school pa nun. Naririnig ko na tong katagang Do what I say but don't do what I do. Ito ang sinasabi nila. So, ito yung mga magagaling mag-advice pero hindi mo naman nakikita sa buhay nila yung sinasabi nila. Palagi nilang sinas minsan nasabi ko rin to. <laughs> yung do what I say but don't do what I do. So, nung time pass by at uh, na-realize ko na itong katagang to is completely wrong. Kasi ang naririnig ko na ngayon is, walk the talk. Kung anong sinabi mo, you have to do it. You have to live by it. So, yun naman ang tama. Kasi yun naman ang, sina yun ang sinasabi ng Biblia. So, <clears throat> so, are we living in the words we teach? or we speak about um, na, ito ay yung kanta yata ni Apple the App yung sa when you practice what you teach yun, yun yung kanta niya na yun hindi <laughs> ako marunong kaman <laughs> ok yun so we have uh, we practice what we teach we practice or we do what we teach or what we say what we advise yun so, today, let's check on this, A Sermon Live by David Kinney. So, tignan natin sa Genesis chapter 6, verse 22. Sabi niya dito, Noah did everything just as God commanded him. So, ano ba tong Noah did everything? If you read the whole chapter of Je Genesis chapter 6, Buti na lang, may women uh, study kami or Genesis study sa mga kami sa women. So, may ma-share ako sa inyo. So, so, sa Genesis chapter 6, sabi niya doon, uh, let me tell you the gist of this. Man began to increase. So, from Adam, then began to increase. So, nag, yun naman ang command niya, go ye and multiply. So, they be, increase, increase in numbers until God saw. Until the Lord ay nalungkot. Dahil nakita niya na God saw man's wickedness and every inclination of the thought of his heart was only evil. Ang, ano ba, uh, hindi ako makapagbigyan ng example ng isang taong um, every inclination of the thought of his heart was only evil. Ma example ko dito is parang si Hitler. Kasi Talagang yun yung isip niya is to conquer the world and to kill and he wants only the original German to live. Yun yung original na intent niya. Bakit ganun? So, kaya pinagpapatay niya ang mga hudyo. 
gusto niya i-conquer the world. Uh, mer- uh, yun siguro, imagine mo kung lahat doon is parang Hitler, lahat ng tao is inclination is evil. Oh no. Everyone is fighting, everyone is killing each other, everyone is uh, speaking profanity. Diba? I can't imagine. That maybe that's the worst time ever. Kaya, ito ang nangyari sa kanila. Pero, sabi niya, pero ito talagang, uh, talagang daw, uh, the earth was corrupt in God's sight. Corrupt in God's sight, not in man's sight. Pero kasi sa, hum- sa ating mata, pag ginagawa ng lahat, okay na. But in God's sight, hindi okay. So, but, pero isa kura, in, 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 lahat, uh, kung tignan natin, ilang peses na sinabi ni Lord na the, the, uh, this, the earth is corrupt, evil, and uh, filled of, full of violence. So, full of violence, imagine that. Maybe nagpapatayan, nagbubugbugan, more than that. So, the world is full of violence. Ilang best niyang inulit yun. Ibig sabihin talagang it is the worst time ever. Aside from hit, um, hindi, hindi siya ma-equal sa kung uh, hindi ma-equal kung gaano ka-evil ang word in the time of Noah. So, but, Noah found favor in the Lord in his generation. So, why he found favor in the Lord? Because, number one, he is a righteous man, he is blameless, and he walked with God. So, <clears throat> hmm, nakas, naka, nakahinga si Lord at least may nakita siyang um, naiiba sa kanyang generation na na sumusunod sa kanya so sabi niya Noah gawa ka ng arka dahil ako dahil ano ba I will flood the earth I will wipe out the mankind the animals, every living creature on this earth if I will flood it. So, ilang beses din niyang sinabi na I will wipe, I will ilang beses niyang sinabi na, I will destroy the earth. Kasi ngayon ang nangyari. So, in instruction ni Lord kung ano ang kalaki, kung ano ang measurement ng arka kanyang gagawin, ano ang height, ano ang haba, ano ang Lapad, ilang doors, ano ang itsura sa loob, sa labas. So, may instruction si Lord sa kanya. Is specific. So, talagang <clears throat> na-engineer yung art na yon In-engineer ni Lord. So, si ginawa din at ginawa ni Noah without any complaint. So, yun. So, ginawa niya. So, within 120 years, in the making, ang ginawa ni Noah is not only making the ark, but also preaching the judgment of God that is coming. So, sinasabi rin niya, uh, repent for the judgment of the Lord is coming, or repent for the Lord will destroy the earth with flood. You know, sinasabi niya every day for 120 days. Pero pinagtatawanan lang siya ng mga tao. Kasi, hindi pa sila nakakita. Even Noah, hindi pa sila nakakita kung anong itsura ng flood. Kung ano ang itsura ng uh, rain. Kasi wala nga ang rain. Eh. Paano mag-flood? Ganon. Yun yung mga ano nila. So, pinagtatawanan siya. So, <clears throat> eventually, here comes the destruction of 
the earth and the only basahin na lang yan and the only save were the family of Noah and uh, every two pairs of animals so Noah uh, exactly obeyed what God directed him to do okay how is it with us we are called the ambassadors in Christ stead we are the only gospel some people may ever read and the only sermon they may ever receive does our life speak of judgment to come Oh, darating na si Jesus Cristo pero nakarelax naman tayo. We are not doing anything. Parang nothing is ganun ba? So, next, does our life speak of living eternity? Are we working for eternity? Uh, ibig sabihin, hindi ba tayo... Um, did people see we are always worrying what we wear are we worrying what uh worry ba tayo kung anong makain did they see worry in us or did they see eternity in us kasi pag we are living uh, we are living for eternity or eternity wala silang makikitang worry sa ating mukha kasi wala silang makikitang uh, problem uh, stress sa ating mukha though may problem man but press but not crash Ayan, nakikita ba nila sa atin yon so nakikita ba nila do our life speak laying up treasures in heaven Dun, yun ba ang nakikita nila that uh, that uh, we are laying treasures in heaven ano pa ba or do the sermons we live have mediocre ito ba ang nakikita na which one ang nakikita nila yung sermon that we live that have is mediocre or the one that we are uh, living in Christ so the world desperately needs a sermon live today and our life or our lives or our life is the best sermon to the people to see okay sabi niya sabi ni francis a schiffer people today are trying to hang on to the dignity of men but they do not know how to because they have lost the truth that man is made in the image of god ito ang nalos even the days of Noah and in the days in the days today nalos na natin yung truth na we are made in the image of God not in not in um, looks but in character so dun sana tayo magdwell that we practice Christ-like character in us. So friends, brothers, and sisters in Christ, let's go back in the beginning that we are made by God's image and likeness. This is a message, a sermon that we should live became a message or a sermon the people to see. Heavenly Father, we praise you and we glorify you. And we thank you for this great opportunity that we uh, know about the life of Noah, that he lived, that he lived the message, that he speak and he lived the message that you are, O oh God, that where we came from that you made us from your image and your likeness help us O oh Lord to live 
in righteousness, to live in a blameless life, and to walk with you like Noah did, to follow you without any complaint, to do everything, everything that you have told us to do without any complaint. That we will do it in um, obedience, in holy fear. So Lord, we thank you. Thank you, Father God. We ask this in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen.